the U.S. Chamber of Commerce is taking a page out of the Donald Trump playbook. And in fact, they're actually using Donald Trump's own talking points in a new study, trying to discredit Hillary Clinton and the entire Democratic Party's energy policy. According to this new report from the U.S. Chamber of Commerce, the largest business front group in this country, Hillary Clinton, if elected, would immediately end fossil fuel production in the United States. And obviously if she does that, that's going to destroy our economy. It's going to destroy jobs. It's going to basically destroy everything that we hold dear. So whatever you do, according to the Chamber of Commerce, don't vote for Hillary Clinton. Now I am no big fan of uh, Hillary Clinton's environmental policies. We saw her flip flop uh, when she told coal industry that, Hey, I'm going to invest $30 billion to get you out of the coal industry and put you in the renewable energy uh, industry. And then she said, you know what? Uh, never mind. Coal is going to be an important part of our energy future. Not a good thing to say, but there has not been a single presidential candidate, including Bernie Sanders or Jill Stein, who, who are both great on the environment has not been a single candidate who has said that they want to immediately end fossil fuel production, uh, offshore on federal lands, um, anywhere in the United States. Nobody has said that this U S chamber of commerce report is completely fiction. And not only that, but their estimates of the economic damage that would be caused if we immediately stop fossil fuel production on federal lands, they're way overblown by about a factor of 10. So yeah, if we stopped all fossil fuel productions, it would hurt the United States at first, briefly, barely. But once we transition those workers into renewable energy fields, train them, give them good paying jobs there, the economy is going to rebound faster than it's ever rebounded from any recession or depression in American history. We have the technology to do that. I would firmly support any candidate that came out and said, the day I am elected is the last day the United States will ever drill, mine or frack on our own soil. I would love that, but no candidate is willing to do that. And for the U S chamber of commerce to come out and try to use this to attack Hillary Clinton, have they not been paying attention to the fact that she has received more money from the fossil fuel industry than Donald Trump? I mean, that's what we should be concerned about. That's what we should be talking about. The U S chamber of commerce should be throwing all of their support behind Hillary Clinton because yeah, she believes in climate change, but just like president Obama, she's not going to do a damn thing about it.